lads, the Chow Chin Chow, Stretch Beats Games here, and welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Red Plus Plus Hard Mode Wonderlock. In the last episode, we made it somewhat through where uh, Mount Moon. We uh, talked a little bit about spoilers, and I actually reflected a little bit on how I got started on YouTube and the situations that YouTube has put me in due to copyright claims. And I could have just told you all this in update videos, but the fact is, I don't really want to do another update video to the end of the series, really. I don't really like doing update videos. My channel is full of them, as we've seen. I'm, uh, to tell you the truth, I've also changed the name of my update videos, too. So, they will now be called... Now, air quotes included, What's the Chow? That's what they will be called from now on. Instead of just the channel update, they're going to be called What's the Chow? So... You know, I'll be telling you all what's the chow. You know, what's going on in the life of Joe's PH games and what's the chow, if you will. <laughs> I like that. I'm actually a big fan of that. You've probably uh, seen me uh, post the thumbnails on Twitter as well, if you've been following my Twitter. And they're really good, actually. I've been working hard on those. That's the thing about my, uh, my GFX now. I'm working really hard on them, so I'm really liking them. I and mean, the GFX for this series are amazing. The ones I made for this series are amazing. And the ones I'm doing for Zeta are looking awesome too. I hope uh, by the time this goes out, Zeta should be out by now. At least part one. At least part one of Zeta would be out by now. So we'll see. This is episode six, by the way. Anyway, so first off, we have Charmeleon here looking at the team. Uh, Charmeleon has Scratch, Growl, Ember, and Metal Claw, level 15. Slight bit of grinding did uh, uh, at the end of the last episode, trying to get back here. Ran into another trainer whilst I was trying to get back uh, from healing. Got destroyed by that trainer, went to go heal again, and then got back here. And running into random encounters all the way as well. So yeah, slight bit of grinding you could call it. So Charmander, level 15. Then we have Onyx, level 17. Same moves as always. Tackle, Harden, Rock Throw, Rock Tomb. Then we have Gloom, level 17. Uh, with Absorb, Acid, Stun Spore, and Minimize. Then we have Seal, also level 17. With Water Pulse, Muddy Water, Headbutt, and Ice Shard. Seal already has Headbutt, so we don't need to worry about Seal learning Headbutt. Uh, Pikachu, level 16. With the moves Thunder Shock, Thunder Wave, Tail Whip, and Quick Attack. And finally, Miss Magnus, front runner at the moment, level 18. With the moves Hex, Confuse Ray, Psy Wave, and Lick. So I'm looking forward to this team. Hopefully today will go a bit further and I'll be able to talk to you guys a bit more about Sun and Moon. Now, I did say I was going to not talk too much about Sun and Moon. I want to be respectful of people who, who want to be not be spoiled. So technically this might be a spoiler episode. If you've watched the trailer, I'll be okay. I'd suggest watching the trailers uh, before watching this episode if you want to. I mean, I don't know what your situations on spoilers are. Do you want to? You want me to talk about Sun and Moon, or do you not want me to talk about Sun and Moon? I guess you could let me know. That's not today's question of the day. Today's question of the day is all about the stardust for Sun and Moon. You know, what are you in? Are you in the owl camp? Are you in the sea lion camp? Or are you in the little house cat camp? Let me know in the comment section down below. I am Litlin. I am Team Litlin. Uh, I am looking forward to. The, I am. Looking forward to using a little one. I cannot wait for it. To tell you the truth, I love cats. I'm a huge, big fan of cats. I love cats. I'm a, I, I'm a cat person. I love cats. I want to get a cat for myself. When I move, I would like to get a cat. Because I love cats. I'm a huge fan of cats. Please don't crit me with, uh, uh, with Karate Chop. It's annoying. Yes, yeah, so I'm a big fan of cats. I love cats. So, Litlan is coming with me on this journey through uh, the Aloha region, I think it's called. Uh, so, I'm guessing it is Hawaii confirmed now. Almost. I haven't said it's based in Hawaii. But then again, Pokemon's never said. Uh, Pokemon outside of X and Y have never said, uh, you know, 
this region is based on this part of Japan. Uh, they never actually, when they released Black and White, they never said that, X and, uh, that Black and White was based on America. They never said it. They honestly never said it. We all knew it, but they never actually said that was a thing. So, you know, if this is based on Hawaii, we'll, we might never know. We're just guessing at this moment in time, saying it kind of looks similar and stuff like that. But I don't know. Maybe it is based on Hawaii. Maybe they have said, and I haven't noticed yet. But honestly, I'm looking forward to these games. I love the starters. I must say, I love the starters. Uh, that little sea lion is so cute. It's based on like a circus. Uh, it's based on like a circus clown, I'm guessing, and I like that. I know there are a few people in the comment section down below, especially my good friend Beck, who doesn't like that. But she doesn't like clowns. I mean, she despises Mr. Mime. I mean, but, you know. I'm not sure she's going to be that much into the hatred campaign for that little uh, that little sea lion. Pabli Pablito or something like that? I think that's how you pronounce it. Pablito? Uh, yeah, but I think she'll be okay with Pablito. As long as it doesn't evolve into some kind of clown, she'll be fine with it. Geodude, that's not good. That's not good. Good for my good friend Charmander. Rock throw is also not good. Muddy water. But we will honestly see. I cannot wait to see what these things evolve into. That little tawny owl as well. It is. Um, I do know a few things about owls, and that is a tawny owl. Uh, the new starter is based on a tawny owl. And I like that. Oh, Dragon Rage. We're learning Dragon Rage. Yes, I want you to learn Dragon Rage. Get rid of Growl. Why would I want Growl when you've got Dragon Rage? I love it. Level 18 for Seal. And Hiker Jeff has a much shop. Can I really water this and get it away before I have to worry about it? Oh, am I going to have to worry about it? Because technically, I'm weak to this. Seismic Toss does equivalent to level, so it's always going to do 17 damage. Uh, that's quite a bit when you think about it. Yeah, it's quite a bit of damage when you think about it. It's, uh, level, it's 17 damage. Oh, an Onyx. I can handle an Onyx. Can you kill the Onyx? Nice, you can. Nice. Nice work, Seal. Okay. So how's the team looking now? Well, I think Pikachu's like the only person who needs some leveling up again. And now Onyx is on level with the team, which is really cool. So Pikachu, you can come to the front of the party and I'll switch you in and out of battle when necessary. Because that's what I like to do. I'm doing some switch training here. And it's working out pretty nicely. I must admit, it's working out pretty nicely at this moment in time. We will honestly have to see if I can keep it going. Ooh, I do not like that. And my microphone is barely picking... It looks like it's barely picking me up for some reason. I don't know. I'm looking at the audacity, I'm looking at the audacity right now, and it doesn't look like it's picking me up. But it is picking me up. It's got to be picking me up. I mean, I'm talking, so it has to be picking me up. We will honestly see afterwards in post. I hope it's picking me up. I did try and calibrate my mic at the end of the recording session, at the end of the last episode, so hopefully it sounds a hell of a lot better. I knew that I need to calibrate my mic a hell of a lot more often uh, when I'm recording, you know, when I do uh, at the start of each recording session, I should calibrate my mic, and I don't do it enough. I really should do it more often. I really should. That's one of the things I really should do. Rocket Grunt. You know what would have been really cool of him to do, uh, of Mateo to do? Give the Rocket Grunts nicknames. So this could have been Rocket Butch, you know, Butch and Cassidy. That would have been cool. Not just Jesse and James, just to have, uh, but to have Butch and Cassidy as well. Whoa! Okay, okay, I'm okay, I'm okay, I'm okay. 
I'm not scared. I'm scared, but I'm okay. You can't kill this on it. You can't kill Onyx. Hyperfang did way too much damage. Onyx Chris level 18. That's a Zubat. I can throw some rocks at that. And kill that easily. Gust should do next to no damage to me. And it does. And what else do you have? You have an Ekins as well. Well, I'm just going to have to go for you. See what happens. Hopefully I can kill. Eventually. I would like to learn Stab Ground though. I think one more rock tomb should kill you. Or rock throw. Nice. Oh my god, that was so good. Thank you, Onyx, for coming in there. That was scary as hell. That was scary as hell. Please never do that again. Okay, what is down here? Oh, Paris! I like that. I mean, I would have been, a, I would have been a big fan of catching a Paris here. But I got Magnemite. I'm okay with that. Now, Magnemite's kind of cool, I guess. I'd like to get, you know, further into this cave without, you know, getting destroyed by random Pokemon. A run. Right. I'm gonna put my repels back on. Where are my repels? Where are my... There they are. And I'm going to stick my running shoes on too. So let's go. Let's run and repels. Run and repel and just get the hell out of this cave now. Ooh. See? Butch and Cassidy. Ooh. Rocket exec... Ooh, you're an executive. You could have some dangerous Pokemon. I mean, you already have a Radada, which can do some serious damage to me. Uh, Onyx, get out of here. Hyperfang is a thing that you can honestly deal with. Onyx, you're really good at dealing with that. And Fenisac is annoying, but I can handle it. Nice. Rock Tomb does so much damage. That was a crit. Ooh, that was a crit too. That was a crit Fain attack. I don't like that. Die. Pikachu goes to level 17. Not bad. Onyx grows some experience too. Mecro. I like the fact that Mecro's in this game. I'm a big fan of Mecro. So there's Nycro. I can go and catch one of those, I guess. Maybe. I mean, I don't actually know where I can get those. You know, we'll see. I like that though. Level 19? Yeah! And Onyx Adrenaline Rock Polish. Uh, no, you're okay. I don't need Rock Polish. And I'm coughing. I can stay in on that. That doesn't do a lot of damage. That does some damage to me, but it's not a lot. I can handle it. I can handle this. Unless you decide to use self-destruct, I'm fine. Unless you decide to... Cr Ooh. On second thoughts, let's heal. And then we'll see what happens. Okay, Leer is annoying. Rock throw. Rock throw has a bit more, a bit more accuracy, and it, I think it does a lot more damage. Actually, to tell you the truth, I think it does more damage. So I'd be happy with doing that. Oh, I don't like the poison, but I do like the kill. Not bad. I do like the kill. Don't like the poison. Do like the kill. Nice. Yeah, you'd be mad. Uh, Patchy Berry. Do I have some? 
I think I have, I think I should have more. There. There we go, cured of your poison. And we can continue on. Is there an item here? There's another moonstone, I knew it. I knew there was another moonstone. Okay, so you should have the, you should be wanting the fossils. Okay. You have a Raichu! Oh, I don't like you having a Raichu here, me with just a Pikachu. Uh, gloom? That does, that does quite a bit of damage. Okay. I don't like you paralyzing me, but maybe I can stun this. Oh. You know Electro Ball? Oh my god, Electro Ball's based on speed. I'm fully paralyzed. Oh my god. Mateo was mentioning this strategy about uh, was mentioning this strategy and I didn't realize he actually gone ahead and done it I was not I'm not liking this strategy stop using electro ball you're faster than me it does so much damage to everything I have in right now I suppose onyx is my only hope You haven't shown you have things that are uh, focused on Onyx. Plus, you can always hit yourself in confusion. So, I'm going to heal. And we'll use Onyx. Hit yourself. No, growl. You can growl. That's annoying. They're confused no more. Damn it. Oh. I'm really scared now because you're confused no more. You can quick attack me. That doesn't do a lot of damage. But then again, I don't do a lot of damage now. With two growls, I do no damage. I literally do no damage to you. Like, literally. You can't hit me with Electro Ball. I have to just chip. I just have to chip away at you because I can't kill you. Uh, that well. I'm out of... I'm out of rock throw. I have to use rock tomb now, and rock tomb will do the exact same damage. But, well, do less damage, but he's growled me again. This is not the way to beat a peak. This has not been the way I beat people, but it's so cheap. But that's just the way I have to do it because I don't have any other way of beating you right now. I need to go and grind. It looks like. I may need to go up to level 25, actually. Yeah, I might need to go and grind everyone up to, like, level 25. Miss Magnus grows to level 19. Gloom went to level 18. Miss Magnus, Trenlin, and Glare. Um, I want to get rid of uh, Lick. And an Umbreon. Wow, that's just a wall. That's just a wall. That's what that is. That's just a wall. And I do next to no damage to the wall. Seal, can you come in here and kill the Umbreon? No, you're going to get confused. Oh my god. Fain attack is stab, and it does so much damage, and I mean, I didn't hit myself. I did not hit myself. And that does nothing to you. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. 
Can I stay alive and just use Dragon Rage on you? Nice. It's a speed tie too. That's how you do it. Charmeleon. Onyx goes to level 20. Onyx is trying to learn defense curl. Um, no, you're okay. Still goes to level 19. Charmeleon goes to level 18. Nice. And we beat Super Nerd Eric. Nice. Okay. I want... I guess I can just take one. I'll take the Helix Fossil. Yes, I want to use another Repel. And can I get to Cerulean today? That's the plan. Get to Cerulean. We'll do a bit of grinding and then we'll see what happens. I don't think he's put more trainers on this route. I really would hope he hasn't put more trainers on this route. He's put a berry tree here. Nice lumberry. Uh, is that, I think this is a new route too, so I can get a new encounter, that means. So, yeah, let's go and get a new encounter. No, I'm fine. Uh, nope, no items here. There's an item, TMO4. What is TMO4 in this game? Steel Wink. Can anyone unload it? No. Okay. That would be pretty cool, though. Steel Wing would be pretty cool. Okay, so here we go. This is a new encounter. Oh, he's made steps. We can get back here. That's awesome. I like that. He's made steps. Spiral! Okay, Spiro. Get, get paralyzed. And just go Pokeballs. But I can't really do too much damage to you. You're not going to have more than 40 HP. Yep, there's a the Spiro. Thank you. Spiro. Teeny bird Pokemon. Eats bugs in grassy areas. It has to flap its wing, its short rings at high speed to stay airborne. Interesting. I'm a big fan of Spiro. It's a good Pokemon. It's uh, underlocked by most people, so I like it personally. Run. And there we go. We are out of the uh, cave. Not bad. We are out of the grass. We are in Cerulean, where I can end off today's episode and go and do some grinding, because that's what I should do. I probably should go and do some grinding. Or I could go and face the rival. I could go and face Nim. I could go and face Blaze. I don't know if that's a good idea or not. I have to sort of gauge based on what I know. And see what happens. I could probably do some potions, so. And some Pokeballs. You know what? Let's do it. Let's go and face the rival. This might be a really bad idea. But let's see what happens. Let's go and see what happens. Also, always save your game before anything bad happens. So I'm going to save that game right now. Okay, this is risky. Yo, Joanne! You're still struggling here along? Back here? I'm doing great. I caught a whole bunch of strong, smart Pokemon. Here, I'll let you see what I caught, Joanne. All right, this is going to be the end of this episode. One way or the other, this is going to be the end of this episode. You start with Jit Jolt. 
You start with a jolty on level 21. I'm not looking forward to this. Uh, I'm going to go into Gloom. Because Gloom resists unless you have Pin Missile, which you probably shouldn't. Yeah, Gloom resists. You don't have Pin. You shouldn't have Pin Missile at this stage. All you can do is Thunder Shot me. I can Acid you. That doesn't do a lot of damage at all. I resist Quick Attack too. I mean, Double Kick. I resist that, so you can do that, but it's not going to do too much damage to me. Absorb is sort of the better move, but you're bulky as hell, and I'm not doing... I'm not doing damage. Why am I not, like, hitting you for good damage here? All I can do is absorb. So, spamming absorb is the best way to go here. Double kick does barely anything to me, though. I like that, though. I'm a big fan of you doing barely any damage to me. I'm not a big fan of me doing barely any damage to you, though. Not a big fan of that. I think I might have to heal. Yeah, I might have to heal. So, potion. There we go. That's nice. Nice bit of healing. Sand attack. Don't like the sand attack. Can I paralyze you? Nice. Now, I want to minimize. I want to minimize again. Make myself even smaller. Even smaller. And then we'll start. Now we're going to start. Now you'll start missing. Now we're going to start destroying you. I know I have two. You have two sand attacks up on me, but I have three minimizers up on you. Really, you can hit before I can. There we go. I have to... Thunderfang? Really? Come on, I've come through. There we go. I have to uh, heal. Whoa, Thunderfang does way too much damage. Now I'm paralyzed. And I have to use my second heat. I have to use another healing item. This is just because of the sand attacks. This is just because of the sand attacks you decide to do to me that I'm getting destroyed by you right now. That's all this is. Sand attack is the thing that's killing me. And the paralyze. Sand attacks and the paralyze. That's what's killing me right now. I'm finally getting somewhere, though. Come on. Nice. The Jolion is finally down. Pikachu goes to level 18. Pikachu is trying to learn Electro Ball. Well, yeah. I'll learn it. Over Tail Whip. Okay. Gloom did really nicely. Nice work there, Gloom. Level 19. You deserve that. Gloom is trying to learn Mega Drain. Yes! Finally, so much better. Absorb. Get rid of Absorb and learn Mega Drain. Okay, now what are you bringing in? Pidgey Odo. Okay. Uh, that's Onyx's domain. That should do next to no damage to Onyx and Rock Throw. That'll do a lot of damage to Pidgeotto. But see, that does almost half. That is awesome. Keep it up. Keep up the nice damage, Onyx. Oh, so close to actually killing him there. Onyx, can you please kill? 
kill the Pidgeotto and don't make me have to worry about it, despite the fact that it just did a, a sand attack. There we go, Onyx. Blooms goes to level 20. Not bad. And Kadabra. I want to stay in. I no longer wanted to... St oh, that was a crit. Oh, my God. Wow. That was a crit. And this is going to be... Yeah, he's going to crit, like, everything now. Oh, my God. I hope I can actually win this still. I just lost Onyx. Nice. Kadabra down. Okay. Radicate coming in. Oh, I have nothing to kill. Eradicate now. I have nothing to kill. Eradicate. I'm. Okay, Sucker Punch shouldn't hit me. That's something you need to fix. Sucker Punch should not hit if you don't hit someone. And Hyper Fang does way too much damage. Okay. I have no way of killing you. Hyper Fang does way too much damage. And Sucker Punch hits every time. Despite the fact that it shouldn't hit. I like the fact you missed a Leah. I don't like this. Okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. Eradicate down. Nice. Nice work, Seal. Gain level 9. Uh, gain level 20. 19. Okay, everyone went up levels. That was awesome. That's not awesome. Um, I have to get someone in. I have to get... I have to go into Gloom. Okay, I'm paralyzed. Okay. Gloom. I need you to I need you to stay bulk to be bulky here. So I can he so I have the chance to heal up almost everybody here. I need you to be bulky. Please say you fixed Razor Leaf. You have fixed Razor Leaf. Okay, that's cool. Then I can finally heal everybody back up to a health where they're manageable. Okay. Then I'm going to go for a stun spore. How? I know I'm not talking right now, but I'm scared. That's why I'm not talking. Scared makes me... Uh, not want to talk at this moment in time. Acid? Is that going to do some damage to you? It does a bit. It's not great. Uh, can I hit you, please? Thank you. Mega Drain does barely anything to you. Okay, but now I could probably bring in Charmeleon. Okay, now, Ember. Nice. Does good damage. Takedown does way too much damage. Okay, I need to heal there. I'm glad I got off a free heal. Ooh. Razor Leaf, don't crit me, don't crit me, don't crit me. Okay, didn't crit.
Wow. Rival Blaze defeated. Hey, take it easy. You won already. Hey, guess what? I went to Bill's and he I got him to show me his rare Pokemon. He had, that added a lot of pages to my Pokedex. After all, Bill was a world famous Pokemaniac. He invented the Pokemon storage system on his PC. He, he, since you're using his system, you should go and spank him. Well, I better get rolling. Smell you later. Wow. Okay. Sadly, we did lose a Pokemon there. But that was pretty good. I will... I think Onyx has earned a nickname, so... I will fish him out of the box when we get... If we get to Lavender Town, I will fish him out of the box and give him a nickname. So, you will get a nickname, Onyx. You deserve that. Box 12 is the death box. I have to remember this. Goodbye, Onyx. You were amazing. And let's switch into there. And withdraw this Spearow. And then we'll... I guess we'll end this episode as soon as we get this Wonder Trade going. So... Let's go and get this Wonder Trade going. Okay, so what do we get for the Spiro? And now I'm going to have to go and do some grinding. What do we get for the Spiro? What do we get for this thing? So, sorry about the almost 40, 45 minute video you're going to get today. I know that it's so long and you guys don't like long videos. Oh my god, I got a magic up. Thanks, Mateo. Thanks, Mateo. I don't want this. Unless you've made magic up great in this game. But I'm guessing your name is not, uh, you know, you're not Dreyanu. You're not Dreyanu. You can't make Magic Up. Uh, you might not have made Magic Up great. I realize that. Nope. It's still for Splash. Anyway, eh, this is where I'm going to choose to end today's episode. So in today's episode, we got for the rest of Mount Moon and we faced our rival and sadly we lost Onyx. I'm not a big fan of that. But I'm going to have to go and do just some grinding. I honestly don't know what I'm, if I'm going to be bringing one of these Pokemon to the PC along with me. I don't need another electric type. I don't really need another water type. So I think I might just run with five Pokemon for a bit and go and do some grinding. So if you enjoyed today's episode, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And today's question day, which of course is, who is your favorite Gen 7 starter? Let me know in the comment section down below whether you'll live Team Litlin, Team Voltlo. Oh, Rolo or something? Roltlo. I think it's Roltlo. And uh, Team Poplin or, uh, Poplin or something like that. But anyway, until next time, I'm Joe PH Games and I am out. See you again. Probably the last thing I talk about with Sun and Moon now.